before you begin the installation, make sure that first the car is turned off so that the mirrors are folded and you will have access to the back side of it and second that the installation area is completely clean. Now if you have the version where the back side and the bottom strip are separate just align them one after the other, spray them with water, uh, spray the installation area and align them. Uh, if you have the version where they are a single cutout, uh, do the same just make sure that both align properly at the same time. Now we provide a spray bottle with the installation kit. This spray bottle is empty, there is no soap in it, unlike other paint protection films that uh, we make. Just fill it up with water. I recommend not adding soap because this is an extremely curvy area and having soap there would make it very very hard to install. So just use clean water and use a lot of it. Now. The risk you're running uh, with clean water is that you might have some bubbles. So make sure you do this in a very well lit environment and you can see if there are any bubbles. If there are bubbles, just peel the film uh, and respray it and re squeegee it so that you can remove the bubbles before the film has cured. Once you've aligned the bottom strip and the back side, uh, it's time to do the really hard one which is the top. The top is the curviest uh, so align the top at the bottom uh, corner where the other cutout meets uh, the top piece. Once you align it squeegee out the water as much as you can and then use a heat gun or a hair dryer uh, to start uh, heating the film. Heating the film would make it softer and it would also evaporate the water which is absolutely necessary for this installation. You you most likely fail this installation if you don't use a heat gun. Depending on how you install this, you might end up with places that have extreme wrinkles and if you cannot handle the wrinkles even with a heat gun and clean water, one thing you can do is to peel the edge of the film and just pull a little bit so you can stretch it a little bit which would relieve the pressure in that area.